I, I think the biggest thing for us was just to get a win because I felt like Sunday we, we really came out and played well um, and we had multiple opportunities to win that game and just didn't get it done. Um, so I was pleased with, you know, considering how Friday and Saturday against Washington went, the way we competed on Sunday was, that was a good sign that we didn't roll over and just wear it and let them just beat us up again. It seemed like we were in a prize fight that they were just holding us up and pounding us and then just wanting to do it again and again and again and again and just not let us hit the mat. Um, but the kids came out swinging on Sunday and I thought that uh, we played well and then we just didn't get it done. And then after Davis came out, you know, we kind of imploded in that 14th inning. So for us to come out today and do it, I think to be honest with you, I think for the, about the first, man, four innings, looked like we were a little bit shell-shocked from the weekend still. Um, you know, Jeremy had a good at bat, got it on base, and then obviously we swing and miss, and they throw it in the center, and they hand us a run back after we handed them a run. Um, so we'll take it. And then I thought later on, I thought um, the kids pitched well. I mean, Huberman's, that's two good outings he's had because uh, we need him. You know, he was a guy we felt going into the year that was going to be a big part of it, and he just hasn't. And so he's made some adjustments, and he pitched extremely well against Washington, maybe one of the two or three kids who did all weekend. Um, and for him to repeat it again today was good to see. Gian threw well again, and, you know, obviously we felt like with Davis out and we needed a win on Strahan's pen day to let him come in and, and get that save. So I think momentum-wise, I think it's good. I think it's always better going into the weekend with a win than a loss. Um, and for us, we just needed a win. You know, we just needed a win just so it's like. <sighs> and, um, you know, we started off the year hot, then we got in a funk, and then we got out of the funk and, and got going again. Um, and had a decent two weeks where, you know, hey, we went whatever, four and four, but um, two tough weekends on the road and, and split in league and then we laid an egg last weekend so now you know we have to turn it up a notch and and play really well this weekend because A-State's kind of on fire they've played two really good teams recently um, back to back that they've won the series from and so it seems like we're catching everybody when they're hot right I mean we caught Loyola twice when they were hot fortunately we were able to take care of them and then we catch Washington who's on fire and um, didn't quite pull out that Sunday and then now we're catching A-State on fire. So that's all right. We just got to play well. I think the same thing I've been saying all year long. See, we haven't played well in a week, and we lost all those games. When we play well, we win. When we don't play well, we don't win, with the exception of tonight. You know, I didn't think we played great, but we ended up winning. So I think um, I, think I told someone last week that maybe the next step in our program is that when we – don't play well and win, that's a good thing. Because then it shows that we're able to win not at our best. And we can't do that all the time because there's too many good teams that we play. Um, but today was we were fortunate and, and we'll take it and now we move forward and we got plenty of things to work on. You know, we get picked off at first on when we're when we're bunning and you know, we're just, we're struggling to get that clutch hit. We're struggling to get out of an inning against Washington this weekend. Um, and then we had a good start from Brent. We needed it um, because other than probably Wyatt's two starts in league, the first two starts, we really haven't had a very good start with the exception of today with Brent. So we need to continue that. We need to build on that for this weekend. And, and for us to beat A-State, we have to pitch well. Uh, and then we're going to have to swing the bats more like we did toward the end of the game than we did at the beginning of the game. And are you concerned about your, your pitching staff going forward? I know last year was the bullpen that you were worried about every game. But this year, your Sunday starter has been, you know, you've used a couple different flux. guys. And it's been in flux. You know, Toomey's struggled a little bit. Um, but... You know, the biggest key for us is that we need to get Bobby throwing well again. Uh, we think we've figured something out. We'll make that adjustment. Hopefully it works out this weekend. Um, because if we have at least Wyatt and, and Bobby consistently going into the seventh, 
then I think we'll be in good shape because the guys in the pen have thrown well. Our issue's been we've been going three and having to suck up six innings out of the pen every start. And then on Tuesday do the same thing. And that just kills them. I mean, you know, Davis has obviously been throwing better than anybody. And we want him to have the ball with the game on the line. We just got to be able to get it to him.